Hello, you guys. Um, I want to just talk to you guys, just pertain this recent um, situation with Chick Fil A um, and the CEO and the president Dan um, Dan Kathy. Um, apparently, um, protesters are saying that uh, Mr. Uh, Kathy is, has said some um, derogatory statements um, pertaining to his faith. Which I don't understand because I'm I'm kind of confused. Um, he didn't bash, and I, I guess I will quote um, some of the things that he did say. Um, 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 according to CNN, because I was watching it today, and he had said some things uh, pertaining to um, that he believed that it should be uh, between a man and a woman. Um, that is his belief. Now, we've been knowing Chick-fil-A has been out, I don't even know how long. We've been eating there for, I don't even know how long. Um, and we all know every Sunday, there is no Chick-fil-A open. It haven't been that way for a long time um, since it's open. That's his belief because of the, of the whole concept is the fact that he's a Christian. He is a Christian businessman that... Um, believes in his uh, faith enough that he puts it within his bylaws and he put it in, inside of what his establishment, his business. It's his business. He has a right to do that. However, he didn't um, slash or bash, I mean, based off of his statement, he was just quoting and stating certain things. It's like if I were to go to a mosque or go somewhere where someone does not believe in eating pork. I'm not going to be pissed off with the guy or woman because they don't eat pork. I'm not going to protest because they don't eat pork. That's their belief. I'm not going to go ahead and give him a hamburger or, 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 or stuff a, a hot dog down his throat. It makes no sense. And with all of these people bashing this, this man for standing up for his belief, just like um, um, a lot of other the people believe in certain um, situations. This is America. Um, um, he have a right to believe, and he have a right to to stay within his faith. Just like a, um, one, it was a young man. He actually um, had, um, you know, he actually had put something in with the police because they were saying that it was discriminating because um, everybody has to have a profile. Their hair has to be cut. Um, their beard has to be a certain way. And so this man actually, one person was, was uh, I think he was Jewish, and the other person was, um, whatever belief he was, he had locks, he had um, braids, and he grew, he grew it um, to a certain length, and they wanted him to cut it. He couldn't cut it because that was what he, he believed in. That was his faith. That's what, he, that's what he believed in. And so with that being said, who is a person that come against a person's belief? You know, now... I will say, if um, if he if if if, if, if Mister um, um, Kathy wanted to say we're going to have prayer um, before we start our business, that's his bylaws. That's his that's his infrastructure. Just like we go to any business, they say, okay, you have to abide by these rules. You have to abide by these regulations. Um, so it's 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 not perplexed um, pertaining to that. He has gotten um, ridiculed, yet he has homosexuals um, in his business, um, he, uh, um, and, 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 and I'm pretty sure owners as well. So when it comes down to it, I see if he was saying, okay, no homosexuals, no lesbians are, um, are prohibited to come into my restaurant, um, nor eat my food, um, or even work for me. And I can say... I can see you actually coming in the midst of, you know, coming against that. And, and that is technically a protest. But this guy is actually saying, this is what I believe. My Bible says this is what God does not stand for. And with that being said, if the man wants to believe that it's for a, originally for a, a man and a woman to be married, who the heck are we to say anything 
to come against that. I think that it is hypocritical because when it comes down to it, just like everybody else who believes in equality, that wants to believe in same-sex marriage, you can't push or bully someone to believe what you want them to believe. Now, if Christians were to do the same thing in which, you know, it's so, be the, so be the case, then so be it. But um, the Bible says also that we love one another. You know, and so when it comes down to it, God would accept anybody when it comes down to it. But one thing that God cannot stand, and some people think that they can be able to sort of rattle the fence and go against it, that's just what God created. If it was not so, we wouldn't be here. If I was not, I would not be here if it wasn't for my mother birthing me. I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for the seed of my father birthing me. It's that simple. That's just the way life works. So that's the way God created it. That's the way it is. Everybody has their own opinion, and that's fine. You know, everybody has their own lifestyle and rights. That's fine. It's nothing wrong with that. You know, um, 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 it, it, it's nothing wrong. You know, you have your own free will. Everybody has their own free will to do what they want to do. It's, 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 it is what it is. We all have free will. However, the Bible says and comes against um these type of lifestyles as such. And that's just the way it is. So you can't come against a man. It's like I can't come against a Muslim and I can't come against a person that is a, that is a, 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 a um, coming from any other type of um, um, belief or, 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 or religion when it comes down to it. I can't push, I can't, me, I mean, I'm a Christian. I can't push, push my uh, 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 faith on another person if they are not open to receive it. Then it, 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 I can't bully myself. I can't bully people into wanting to believe something that they don't, they're not ready for, or they just don't want. So it's just that simple. So people, I think we need to get some areas together because um, for y'all to ban this man's business for him believing in something that his Bible and his faith has brought him to this place. Or, or brought him to the point of being successful. That's his belief. That's what he believed. That's his religion. It's that simple. It's it just doesn't make any sense. I mean, it's it's it it it, it does. It's not. It's the way things are going. It's just not. It's not. He's not even right. I'm like to the point that you're gonna bash Christians or bash people for saying. And I see now if a Christian will say something out of their mouth. That was to the point of saying, I wish all gays would just die and I wish all homosexuals would do this. And that ain't that ain't God. That ain't flesh. We're supposed to love everyone, love people. You know, you don't want to push in nothing on anybody. You pray for them. And, you know, and that's just what it is. You know, but it's not for nobody to come up against um, um, a person because of what they believe in. That's just what it is. I mean, people need to stop. That's, that's it's sad. Um, give me some feedback. Let me know what you think.